Tralala pom pom diga diga do. Here's a question just for you. Fuddle duddle diddle dee u p i u. Where, when, which, why, how, and who? If that's asking such a lot, shrimp up a fiddly pom tick tack tot. Then just simply guess what? Guess what? Guess what? Pa 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 pum with Jan Rubesh. And I have another guess what game for you. Guess what this is? It's a round brown box, right? It's a round brown box. But what's in it? It's not a can of worms, no. Maybe it's a jack in the box. Well, I open it. <laughs> It's not a jack in the box. It's empty. No, it isn't empty. There's a little cylinder in it. Little black cylinder. What is it? What is it for? Oh wait. There's a man on the box. He looks like an ordinary man, doesn't he? But I tell you, he was not an ordinary man. He was a wizard. Or not the kind that uh, that does magic tricks, or wears a tall hat like this. Oh, come on, get me out of here. Oh, this is not a hat, it's a big tall trumpet. And I tell you a secret, this little box and the trumpet, because of those two things, this man on the box was called a wizard. But before I tell you more about that, I have to do one thing today. I have to record a song. I have everything ready for that. Here is my microphone. Here is my accordion. And the song is going to be about something you know very well, the school cafeteria and what they gave us to eat there. I've eaten in mighty fine diners in hamburger places as well. I've eaten in restaurants and drugstores, all right, and some were the best in the town. The last one, a school cafeteria, so nice, so clean, so neat. But you'll wonder that I am still living when you hear what they gave us to eat. On Monday we had bread and gravy. Tuesday it was gravy and bread. Wednesday and Thursday it was gravy and toast, which is nothing but gravy and bread. So Friday we went to the principal and asked for something instead. On Saturday morning, by way of a change, we had gravy without any bread. And now a record is going to be made of the song, and you and I can hear it again and again and again. And all that because of the man on the book. And his name was Thomas Alva Edison, and he invented the phonograph. Your record player was invented by Thomas Alva Edison. Of course, when he first made it in his workroom in Menlo Park, that's what his workroom was called, Menlo Park, the machine, the phonograph, didn't look much like the phonograph you know. It looked like this. And nobody believed that it would work. Nobody would believe that a machine could bring your voice back at you. There was only one place before that people could hear their voices. That was in the mountains. When you call across a valley and you would call, oh, my name is Jan, so you can call Jan, and the voice will come back, Jan. But nobody believed that a machine like this could repeat your voice. But Edison believed it, and he even bet some cigars. So one day he assembled all his workers around him, and he cranked this machine up. He opened this gate, slipped one of these cylinders on, closed the gate, 
put the needle on and added a little tube here. Right? Now I have to tell you that Mr. Edison was hard of hearing. And so he always spoke very loudly. And when he sang, ah, oh. anyway, he sang, put the machine on. Mary had a little lamb, little lamb, little lamb. Mary had a little lamb, its fleece was white as snow. He stopped the machine. Cranked it up again. And he said to all these people around, now you will hear my voice. Nobody believed it. He added this big tube to make it sound bigger, I guess. And he put the machine on and... Mary had a little love, little love, little love. Mary had a little love, his fleet was white as snow. It works! It works! Everyone shouted. The phonograph was invented. The very first record in the world has been made. And since then, everyone in the world called Mr. Edison the Wizard of Menlo Park. But to think of it, that the first record made was made of Mary had a little lamb. And of course, it was made on a cylinder, not on the flat record, you know. Now, I made a recording on one of those old Edison cylinders. And I will play it for you. All I have to do is slip it back on the right way, close the gate, crank up the machine, put the needle in place, start the machine, add this on, and here we go. Run along home and jump into bed. Say your prayers and cover your head The very same thing I say unto you You dream of me and I'll dream of you Run along, run along, run along, run along, run along Run along home and jump into bed Say your prayers and cover your head The very same thing I say unto you You dream of me And I'll have nightmares 